Hey, what's up, YouTube? This is your boy Ron Tastic, aka Ron Second to None, back with another video for Ronda for Aquarium. Continue on with the series of Better July. Um, this is our day two, and this is our second better tank we're gonna set up. So let's get started. Okay, what we have here is another 10 gallon tank, and you know the first line of business is getting this tank filled with water. Okay, you guys, the hose is in the tank. Let's get the water turned on. It's just about a quarter filled. Just shy of three quarters We're field. Go ahead and call this field, you guys. Next up, you guys, we have the dechlorinator. Okay, you guys, so what I have here is my top fan beta water conditioner. It makes tap water safe for fish. Per directions of the bottle, for every half a meal, um, no, I'm sorry, for every one gallon, you add a half a meal. For every two gallons, you add two meal. So, we know that we're doing a 10 gallon tank. So that's gonna be five mil. And you guys know that top fan products come with this graduated top for easy measurement. It measures from one, five and 10 mil. So I'm just gonna go ahead and send, go to the five mil line. Five mil and the tank it goes. Next up you guys, we have gravel. Gravel has been rinsed, and this, I know it looks like the same as the other tank, but it's a little lighter. It's a little lighter. Gravel's in. Next up, onto the core. Next up, onto the core. The core is in the tank. Now on two filters. Okay, you guys, we have the same filters from the last tank. The top fan B5, BF5, Beta Flow. It um, quietly filters 20 gallons per hour um, for use up to a five gallon aquarium. You notice it's a 10 gallon aquarium, so we're gonna put two of them on. Okay, you guys, so filters are in. Next thing is heaters. Now, I, don't, I have one of the same heaters I used on the last tank, but I also have a different one. They're both ready for five gallons. And this is a 10 gallon tank, so I'm gonna use one of each, but just know that they both are ready for five gallons. Okay, you guys, this is also a bubbler, so it requires an air pump. So I got an air pump for it. This is the top fan air. 1000 air pump it's great it's ideal for a 10 gallon aquarium and it's going to just use one of these okay i have the air pump in place i'm not going to connect it right now um but i will by the time we get the tank together but let's get everything plugged up and get this thing working okay you guys so everything's plugged up except for the air pump which i'm going to connect now but let me turn the lights off so you can see it lights up the um that's the ship lights up but it's not as i guess let me see let me turn the lights out this is with all the lights this on this with the room lights out it's still a little glare so let me turn the um aquarium light off and see what it looks like okay you guys kind of disappointing i think this would do better if i had uh aquarium where instead of facing it sideways i would face it front to back and i guess we will see more of the lit light so but okay anyway. you guys so there we have it as always i want to thank you for coming along on this journey with me and viewing my channel don't forget to like share comment subscribe and i'll catch you on the next one peace okay you guys now it's time for the fish reveal and what we have today is the king male veil tail we're gonna call him king george this is king george and this is his ship so let's get him in his tank 
Okay, King George is exploring his ship. We may lose him, so we're probably going to have to come back when he gets acclimated and used to the tank and start swimming in front. Okay, you guys, and there you have it. As always, I want to thank you for viewing my channel, my videos. Don't forget to like, share, comment, subscribe, and I'll catch you on the next one. There he is. Look. And here's a front view. I guess you get more light, but all right, you guys, I'll see you on the next video.